a mistake has been made and I shouldn't really be here. It's a play. I'm in a play called Marat Sand. The play that changed British theatre forever. No pressure there then. And I'm playing the Marquis de Sand. I didn't know much about the play. I didn't know anything about Marat. I had the, only the basic kind of knowledge about the Marquis de Sand. He's famous for his sexual perversions, but he was also a writer. It's, I think it's important to perhaps separate the two if you can. There was a mind in there somewhere, you know, certain intelligence and power. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm not necessarily going to play the Marquis de Sade uh, in a historical sense or even... Did that happen for you or was it just for me? It's... Something's happening to my eyes. But it's no good playing de Sade if you're gonna... If you're gonna fall down and die like a hammer's hit you, is it if somebody goes boo at you? You've got to be the one going boo. And get the others to go boo. My mission is, is to try and um, offend my fellow company members, unsettle them, unnerve them, freak them out. I freaked them out quite well on Friday, but I can't tell you about that. Otherwise I'd have to kill you. <laughs> I hope it'll be weird, I hope it'll be frightening, I hope it'll be funny. I hope the audience think, how did they do that? How on earth did they get themselves into a state of mind where they all felt they could do that? It's a play about revolution, isn't it? A play about two different kinds of revolution. There's a, there's a debate there, and I suppose that's something people could think about if they choose to. I don't think most people feel, really. I think it'd be better to try and bypass their brains a bit. Try and get round the back. Some way, do you know what I mean? Get round the back a bit. This is not really a sort of, you know, we've got a message for you and you, you'll feel better after you've, you've had two and a half hours of us banging it into your head like nails. There's nothing. Hey! Going on in my head.